Hey everybody, what's going on? I am Greg Sussman, joined today by Tom Vecchio of FanDuel, who's here to break down the top values on tonight's NBA slate. What's going on, Tom? I'm doing good. We got values tonight. Close out another NBA week. Let's get to it. Let's begin tonight with the Indiana Pacers, specifically in their front court with Goga Batate. The Pacers' big man is priced under $5,000 tonight. And with Miles Turner out, Goga in a good spot. So, Tom, some would say it's go. Good time. That's right. It's time for Goga. And when Turner is off the court this season, we see him producing 1.20 FanDuel points per minute. We saw him have a big game the other night against Minnesota. Very high scoring game, like 140, 137, or whatever it ended. And we know that Turner's going to be out tonight. And like I said, 1.20 FanDuel points per minute is what he's producing. We also have Sabonis and Brogren questionable for the Pacers. And when they are both out, when all three of them are off the court, we see that bump up to 1.26 FanDuel points per minute. You know, it's a 219 over under against the Magic. It's not amazing, but he's under $5,000. So he should be playing 25 to 30 minutes tonight. I'll take the value with Goga. Whenever Miles Turner isn't on the court, Goga is somebody that has a ton of value. In, with Brogdon questionable, with Demontis Sabonis questionable, you could be getting a lot of Patazza here this evening at $4,900. Something strongly to consider in your DFS lineups tonight. Moving over to Denver, Monty Morris is priced under $4,000 tonight, and he could be in line for a lot of playing time once again. Jamal Murray is questionable this evening, and Morris started earlier in the week, then head to the bench the next night. Does it matter here, Tom, if Murray is out, if Morris starts or not? Ideally, we'd like to see him in the starting lineup, but we know that Denver ultimately runs a pretty deep bench, and we see a lot of their bench players see a good amount of minutes on a nightly basis. I want to say, you know, we are more confident if he's going to be starting because he's under $4,000, but I still think he has value. He's producing 0.92 FanDuel points per minute when Murray is off the court. I think it's just a simple plug and play. We've seen Denver on a roll right now since they added Aaron Gordon, and whether it's Barton or Gordon or uh, Michael Porter Jr., who's looked very good, or of course, Jokic. Anyone in their lineup is a viable fantasy option. Specifically, I think Morris is in a good spot uh, going up against the Spurs, relying 49.10 fading points per game opposing point guards. That's the seventh worst in the league. So it's better if he's going to be starting, but I'll take him either way tonight on under $4,000. As long as there's no Jamal Murray, Monte Morris is a plug and play here on FanDuel under 4K. Uh, him in your DFS lineup, lots of like. Morris always very, very solid uh, without Murray. Hopefully, he's in the starting lineup for Denver this evening. One final player to get to here, and that's the Warriors big man, James Wiseman. Wiseman, the number two overall draft pick this past draft, is under $5,000 tonight. It's been an inconsistent rookie year for Wiseman. Why is tonight somewhere where you're looking forward to playing him? So the Warriors are taking on the Wizards tonight, and it's setting up to be a great fantasy environment. We have a 238.5 over under. The Wizards are number one in the league when it comes to pace. The Warriors are number two, and right now we see the Wizards allowing 58.37 FanDuel points per game to opposing center. So yes, as you said, Wiseman has been a bit inconsistent this year, but... We are taking the matchup. He's under $5,000, a phenomenally paced game with number one and number two in the league, a super high over-under, a phenomenal defensive matchup. There's nothing not to like about Wiseman tonight. That inconsistency has been there in the wrong matchup tonight. Not that. With this total approaching 240 here and facing off against a brutal Wizards front court, James Wiseman in position to really help your DFS lineups here, especially priced under $5,000 tonight. That's going to do it for us here on the FanDuel Hurry of Tom. We appreciate the time. Good luck to Night. Same to you. Talk to you next week. Absolutely. I cannot wait. Enjoy your weekends, everybody. Have fun watching the Masters, the NBA, MLB, and a whole lot more. For Tom Becky, I'm Greg Sussman. Have a wonderful weekend. I'll see you back here on Monday for another edition of the FanDuel Hurry Up.